wait, hold on. Somebody's calling me. <laughs> Mike Morris? Hello? Hello? Please let me in. It's please. Let me in. Stevie Lou said, please let me in. Oh. <laughs> He doesn't say nothing. He doesn't say nothing. Put st- uh, uh. Jesus fucking <laughs> Christ, man. I'd be pissed if I were you, Stevie. I really would. Hey, Pat. Hey, how you doing? What's your problem? I I would ask you that. I, I What do you mean, what's my problem? I think that people who sucker punch are losers. And I okay. think that you're I a loser. Think I think you're a loser who sucker punches. How about that? Well, I mean, you know, if you've done anything ever in this business, I might listen to you. But you haven't, man. You're nothing. You're just some that's, dude. That's why, your, why do I care? So, so who why are you? do I care? Who are you, Pat? Let me ask you the same question. Who I've had a long, storied career with many accomplishments in comedy. Yeah. How many clubs are you allowed to walk into in all New York of them. City, buddy? Literally oh, all, all of them. them. No, no. See, Pat, you have a, a bad problem with your anger. And I, I'm here to well, make sure you don't forget it. I want to make sure that you really, don't forget it. Because, hey, hey, how about Felicia? Make you... What? Kevin's <laughs> amazing with the gun. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm not going to fucking... I'm not going to do allegedly. I'm not doing yeah, like... that's what allegedly. it is. Okay, look, if you come back, you come back and don't bring up... Bring up just this. Did, did, you, you, did you drive Felicia? Did you drive her to a Waffle House? Like, I, we don't care. We don't yeah. care. Driver. Look, I, whatever she says and whatever she's saying. And him, you didn't, you didn't listen. I don't know. I, I'm not, the, I'm not the, I'm not, I'm not a grand jury. I'm not the legal system. Right. But a sucker punch is when the guy doesn't see you coming. He saw it. Ele- allegedly, he saw you coming. Allegedly. Well, yeah. Before the alleged thing, yeah, he was looking right at me. But I mean, yes, whatever. that's not a sucker punch. That's not a sucker punch. If a guy's talking, if a guy's being a c- with his guinea charm and his olive oil skin, <laughs> and, and and all day long he's being a, c- and then you show up there to look him in the eye, and he's, and then you call that a sucker punch. That's not a sucker punch. A sucker punch is when a guy, you, a guy, you come up from behind him, and you have no relationship with him. Uh, uh, you cover that in New York's crime stories, right? New York Sometimes City crime report. It happens. It happens from time to time. Somebody yeah, a guy walk will up just, behind a person, a punch just him. walk up behind a guy and just he has no relationship with him, and he'll just tap him on the shoulder and just fucking knock him out. Yeah, like Anthony that's a Curran. sucker punch. Yeah, that's 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 how I see it. That's how I see it. But not I mean, if you're like, talking shit. It would be like if, if Stevie Luke came up to me after this episode and he walked up to me and then he took a swing at me. I'd be like. It's not a, no, it's not a sucker punch because we've been interacting all fucking day. Or, yeah. or, if, one, or if the dues payer came up to me at, at one of the clubs that he doesn't work at and he, and he comes up to me and, like, would it be a sucker punch? No, I would be expecting something from the dues payer. Well, I'm allowed in every club in New York City. That I know. There's an, it's not like word got around. He has an anger control problem. He can't come inside this club. But that is, that's not happening. That's ridiculous. Hmm. Sorry. Oh, hold uh, on. I got a call coming in. Is I'm right? Who could Hello? Be? I won't bring up whatever I can't bring up. He won't bring up whatever he can't bring up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, hey, hey. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You guys are good. You guys are good. Are you playing Jaws, Pat? Yeah. Jaws. The guy just mentioned Jaws in a super chat that uh, went on. All right, go ahead. Go ahead, Stevie. Stevie. How are you? Pat. Yeah. You have a problem with me? (laughs) Let's talk. I have some questions. But you've already answered them. You said I never want anybody to forget. It's, it's, my show. Show. it's your it's show. My show. It's your show. Pat, Pat, ask your questions. It's come on. I, well, you've already answered it, really. And no, so, no, no, now, now we're I open. Any, I, I really said no... I won't say what I won't say, so I won't say that. But let's Whatever. go now. You and you and I, you and I. Okay, man to man. Me. You've been talking That's about me nonstop. You and I on podcasts <laughs> and Twitter and shit like that. You say a bunch of shit. 
even added my ex-wife thinking she's gonna like what dig up dirt on me or some shit so like i don't know man i mean like it hey. seems like you have a problem with me i never had any beef with you pat i think that you are the lowest scum on this earth and i think that i'll be the person who steps on your face when they bury when they bury you when they bury you six feet underground because you were a no one and you'll always be a no one and the only thing you'll ever be remembered for was punching gino bisconti so just please well, make sure that you have that in your brain before okay. you move before you move next just know wait, that, wait, that you'll no, always wait. be known by that. That's the only no one knows next. No one knows no no one knows about what Pat do you Dixon. Mean by that, no one knows man. about you. What? Wait, he wouldn't let me talk. Wait, what Stevie, Stevie. Stay, stay there, Stevie. You're saying you're saying Pat is the lowest scum on the earth compared to Gino Bascante? Well, I'm even lower than everybody, you know, even. And yeah. he said the only yeah. reason Pat is, will ever be known for is for a punch in Gino. That, yeah. yeah, but how can you say someone's low, more scum of the earth than, than Gino Bisconti? Is that what he said? Is that, let me just get this right. Yeah, let's get. Uh, is that what you said? Pat, I, Stevie, that's what you said. He's the lower, he's the lowest scum of the earth. He's lower than Gino Bisconti, your boy. If I, if I had to flip a coin. <laughs> Who's the bigger scumbag than yes, Pat Dixon? Gets Wait, why the, would you flip a coin? Gets the yeah, coin. If it's on yeah. a coin flip, you let the coin decide. Yeah. I love to gamble. So, Pat, why don't you come through to Atlantic City <laughs> I'll on be there. April 18th? I'll, you will? Okay, why don't you bring the 19th? I'll be there the 19th. I'll be there the 19th. I, I don't know if I'll be there the 18th. August 19th. It's, it's, make, it's make not April. Sure, make sure your little Asian massager is there because i want to fuck you and ouch yeah i'm the inf i'm the enforcer bob i'm the enforcer okay you know like so... in, M in mlb you know when you're the team that's up by like a hundred and then this little punk, mlb this little punk over Baseball. here wants to come up at bat and he hits one home run he hits one home run by wow. guessing he guessed he guesses you guessed strike and you caught a lucky pitch. So I'm the guy who comes in the next inning and I puts one right back at your fucking face, Pat. And so now where the fuck are you? Where, where are you? Where are you? You admit it you wasn't know? a sucker punch then? Is that what you're saying? I just so, would like to say that. Are you admitting you, it wasn't a sucker punch? You want to come it either, punch was it me. lucky or sucky? You are a sucker punching bitch. And that's okay. who you are. So can I just make well, sure I that's disagree. Clear? But Stevie, why do you why do you want to punch Pat if punching people is bad? Because you well, know yeah. what? Like I said, I'm the enforcer. I'm the enforcer you're on the enforcer? everybody's team. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're, you know, you're, you're, you're heard Anderson. Of yeah, yeah, but uh, yes, I already yes, got yes, fired. Bob. I already got okay. fired. That's uh, that's. I, I think. Anthony but I hear was the you. I and, hear you. Not only that, but I also, you know, I've had to face all right, but I as well. So there's been court, and I've been fired. Why? Why are you needed? Because you're still around chirping like you were a chirping. tough guy. Yeah, you're not what a tough guy, Pat. Doing? You're a I little punk around bitch. talking about this. I don't and, know where I'm talking and, about And, and Asian you're Ryan Katsu Rivera is another bitch. Up? Why do because, you bring him up? Because he's your bodyguard, I guess, and he needs you to fight your That's fights. You're he needs you up. to fight your fights. What? He, he texted needs me. To fight me. My fights? Yes. Yeah, because I will fucking you like the little worm that you are pat and i'm oh, here to put the final I, I am dropping the final pieces of dirt on your shit bag garbage career okay. so that's what stevie lou is you remember how you're how like, are you oh, doing that yeah. exactly. remember when you used to play piano how are you how are you doing that kevin isn't this better than me and you fighting what is his deal <laughs> he is so weirdly personally offended by me <laughs> I remember, All right, I'm not going to sell my piano. show. Was, I'm not going to sell my show. You know what I, I do like remember? This show is good again. I'm glad like of your that. faith is restored. I remember when he did Bringers at Dangerfields. Why, well, he's mad that you used to play piano at Dangerfields? Apparently, that makes me a bad person. But Dangerfields is closed now. It doesn't exist anymore. Yeah, but you used to play piano when and how? 
Uh, I would get, at Dangerfield, sometimes I would play the piano uh, on stage. You know, there's before a the grand show, piano. Before the show. Yeah. yeah, or, you know, sometimes even when comedians were on, if they wanted, it would happen sometimes. And I also did a show there where I would have, you know, people on and I would, like, play them on and off and stuff. It was fun. It wasn't a big deal. So, I mean, Pat, I, mean, I, you, I can't you, believe you brought it up. I had forgotten about that. Do you have an enforcer, too, from what I'm catching? Oh, do I have an enforcer? Because uh, that you have an Asian assassin no I that's asian that's assassin. asia pat dixon right yeah he's a guy who yeah, uh, we got anthony torito he's fine and we got melton will be there we'll be fine we'll be fine i, I don't know if melton's gonna <laughs> melton <laughs> six five no, three he's huge. yeah but i mean like uh you know he doesn't have a dog in the race or anything i can't imagine him starting to swing but uh you send him he, some super chats he'll have a dog in a race send him some okay, yeah. maybe i'll buy some <laughs> fucking kill people with a steak yeah, buy know. some of his merch uh, yeah. Detroit Mike, worst story ever. Joey C makes more sense. Hack sent Jared from Subway the link. <laughs> <laughs> I'd love to get him on, Jared from Subway. Yeah, he, he's making the rounds. I never thought I'd say this, but send <laughs> Ray. <laughs> yeah. I was sending Ray the link. I think this is when we were interviewing Stevie about the fucking about the beach party. We're way behind. <laughs> Let me know how much to to send to get Stevie Law for another two minutes next time. Yeah, yeah, everybody. Yeah, I was getting frustrated too because I was like, just tell the story. Don't try to make it funny. Just just tell the story, and don't try to make you guys heroes. I live to serve, Deadpool. Thank you, Deadpool. <laughs> he loves it. And I hope he, I hope you're not mad that uh, I brought him back on. But I had a I had a. They've been talking about coming uh, back on. You know, face to face forever, and I, I don't think Pat really gave a shit. Not really. I just—he's so angry at me, and he—he and he shows it all the time. I'm like, I don't get it. I mean, I, I've never done anything personally to him, and uh, yeah, yeah, he acts like he—he he was like work for Gino, or he's somehow he's tight with Gino, but he's not tight with Gino. He just—he's offended by what you did, and I'm—I'm—I'm I'm, I'm the total mm. opposite. I'm offended 100 by what Gino did. Were you he, two ever friends? Me and him, Stevie Lou? Yeah. Well, we were friendly. But like, I mean, he, he was known to the secret shows. Yeah, right? no, no. Plus, he would work at Compound. He was on the East Side Dave show, so they would see each uh -huh. other probably. Yeah, he, well, yeah, we'd see him there. And then I also saw him at the secret shows. And I also saw him at, uh, yeah, I remember the, one of the shows up on Long Island at a governor's. I don't remember which one. And he was, uh, yeah, I was having a conversation with somebody else. He came walking over, and I think he was a little bit, uh, had, had some. I don't know, whatever. I don't want to. I don't want to cast any aspersions on the guy. He never says anything bad about me, right? But uh, <laughs> I think he, he was, was smoking. He was smoking crack. He was coked up. Uh, he, 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 you know that pe sometimes people talk like you know, just with uh, they just keep talking. It was kind of like that. Yeah, but anyway, I don't know. I mean, maybe that's just he, he just got suddenly gregarious and friendly and stuff. But he uh, anyway, I just walked away from the conversation. He was talking to the guy then, so it was fine. But uh, I I don't know him hardly at all. I never really no. We never had any problem that I know of. But he's the enforcer. He says, <laughs> Arn Anderson. It doesn't really uh, matter. Ski mask Piazza Fest. Yeah, can you imagine being at that beach? I, I mean, I definitely mean, be wearing a one piece. Jason Bentley. At this point, KB, I'll buy this show from you just to cancel it. Stevie Lou. <laughs> Dragging a dumb ski mask story was the final nail. Yeah, I'm with you. I'm I'm 100 with you, Bentley. We're done. I'm gonna quit my own show. But then, the, but this I've been I've been uh, invigorated by this uh, Stevie Lou uh, Pat Dixon uh, feud. Unless Andy is at Steve's, unless Andy is at Stevie Speedo Piazza Beach Fest, who cares? <laughs> Andy's coming in hot this summer. Hell yeah. I don't like you calling it a feud. I, it's not a feud. I have no feud. I know, it's all one-sided. You know. I know. I'm just I'm embellishing. <laughs> <laughs> Thank goodness he's gone. I couldn't, I couldn't stand a story of some Piazza Beach Bank Fest story by a guy obviously high on shrooms. <laughs> How do you guys know what someone's high on? It just, every drug has. No, I don't, but you guys seem to know. It's amazing yeah. to me. 
Why are you so nervous? What are you on? I have the way you just take his word for it instantly that he was high on shrooms. No, but this no, but you, things. but you said you saw him at the party and he thought he was high on this he, or high yeah, on outside. He, 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 what it seemed like it, but you know how that is, right? If you know yeah. somebody's normal baseline and then they're like way up here. Yeah, but I yeah, but I could tell they're different, but I don't know what they're what's making them. I don't know what they're on. Okay, yeah, yeah you can tell. Look, somebody said I'm high on edibles. They are correct. It's a simple thing, and uh, er, drug weed is a certain way, coke is a certain way, mushrooms is a different way, heroin kind of easy to figure out. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Talking about Artie Lang now. 